light, and love over darkness, death, and despair. The choice is yours. Will you choose to follow Jesus and walk in the path of righteousness, or will you continue to be led astray by the lies of the enemy? The choice is yours, but remember, the consequences of your choice are eternal. Jesus is calling you to come to him, to surrender your life to him, and to experience the true freedom and joy that comes from walking in his light. Will you answer his call? Will you choose to follow him and receive the blessings that come with obedience? The time is now. The choice is yours. Choose wisely, for your decision will shape your eternal destiny. Jesus is waiting for you with open arms, ready to welcome you into his loving embrace. Will you come? Will you choose life? The choice is yours. You are coming into destiny moments. I am about to take you where you couldn't go on your own. What is coming your way is going to be unusual. What you have been praying for is going to happen sooner than you think. The dysfunction, the lack, and the sickness is over. This is a new day. There's about to be a turnaround. It's your time to reign. The forces that have held you back are being broken right now. Good breaks are about to find you, and the right people are about to show up. You're going to reign over the sickness, reign over the depression, and reign over the struggle. Healing, promotions, breakthroughs, and blessings are coming your way. Be encouraged. You have been waiting for this moment, praying for a change, hoping for a breakthrough. And now, it is finally here. The obstacles that have been standing in your way are being removed. The chains that have been holding you back are being broken. You are stepping into a new season, a season of abundance, of prosperity, of victory. You have been through so much, faced so many challenges, but you have never given up. You have kept the faith, you have persevered, and now you are about to see the fruits of your labor. The struggles of the past are behind you. The pain, the suffering, the heartache, they are all fading away. You are stepping into a new beginning, a fresh start, a new chapter in your life. You are about to experience a level of success, of joy, of fulfillment that you have never known before. The blessings that are coming your way are beyond anything you could have imagined. You are about to be lifted up, to be elevated to new heights. You are about to soar like an eagle, to run and not grow weary, to walk and not faint. You are about to reign over your circumstances, to take control of your destiny, to become the person you were always meant to be. You are about to step into your purpose, to fulfill your calling, to make a difference in the world. You are about to shine like a beacon of light, to inspire others, to bring hope to the hopeless. You are about to experience healing, both physically and emotionally. The pain that has been weighing you down is being lifted off your shoulders. The wounds that have been festering are being healed. You are being restored, renewed, rejuvenated. You are being made whole again. You are about to receive promotions, both in your career and in your personal life. The doors that have been closed to you are being flung wide open. The opportunities that have been out of reach are now within your grasp. You are about to step into a new level of success, of influence, of impact. You are about to experience breakthroughs in every area of your life. The barriers that have been blocking your path are being demolished. The walls that have been standing in your way are crumbling to the ground. You are about to break free, to break through, to break out of the limitations that have been holding you back. You are about to be showered with blessings, with favor, with abundance. The good things that you have been longing for are about to come pouring into your life. You are about to be surrounded by love by joy, by peace. 
you are about to be filled to overflowing with all the good things that life has to offer. So be encouraged, my friend. Be hopeful. Be expectant. Be ready. Your time has come. Your destiny is calling. Step into it with confidence, with faith, with courage. Embrace the new season that is dawning upon you and watch as miracles unfold before your very eyes. This is your moment. This is your time. This is your destiny. Now listen, it's important that you pay attention to what I'm about to say. I won't ask again. The devil is out there trying to lure you away from Jesus. He's using unbiblical rituals to gain control over you, to lead you astray. He wants you, innocent as you are, to suffer in hell as part of his revenge against me. But I defeated him, crushed him under my feet. The devil wants you to ignore Jesus, to turn away from the Bible and righteousness. But if you stick to the teachings of the Bible, if you hold fast to Jesus, the devil will start to fade away. Remember Matthew 28, 8, where it talks about the authority of the devil and his demons. But also remember Matthew 28, 18, where it's made clear that Jesus has all authority now. That means that Satan has no power over Christians. I fought him and I won. Promise me that you will never be envious, that you will always strive to do what is right and righteous. I've done my part. Now it's up to you. If you're on my side, if you're with Jesus, press the like button. But if you disobey, if you choose to follow the devil, then press dislike. It's a battle, a spiritual war that's being waged for your soul. The devil is cunning. He's trying to lead you astray. But if you hold fast to Jesus, if you stay true to the teachings of the Bible, then you will be safe. The devil has no power over you if you have faith. Don't let the devil win. Don't let him lead you down the wrong path. Stay strong. Stay true to Jesus. Remember, I have already defeated the devil. He has no power over you if you believe in Jesus. So I urge you, don't skip this message. Listen to what I'm saying. The devil is out there trying to deceive you, trying to lead you astray. But if you stay close to Jesus, if you hold fast to the teachings of the Bible, then you will be safe. I have faith in you. I know that you can resist the devil's temptations. Stay strong. Stay true to Jesus. Don't let the devil win. Remember, I have already defeated him. He has no power over you if you believe in Jesus. So, I leave you with this choice. Will you follow Jesus? Or will you follow the devil? The decision is yours. But remember, I will always be here, watching over you, guiding you towards the light. Stay strong, my child. Stay true to Jesus. And together, we will defeat the devil once and for all.